Alright guys, so today we're going to talk about what goes into an effective paragraph, but first, who here has read To Kill a Mockingbird? Alright, great. So you already know that like it's an awesome book about uh, racial inequality and the dangers of stereotyping, and also a great story, um, so I don't really need to summarize a ton of that, but um, as you might or might not know, last week Harper Lee died last Friday, and there were a bunch of obituaries in the New York Times. So here's one written by a lawyer with slightly tweaked vocabulary, and uh, we're going to analyze that and see if it's good writing or not, like what parts of it we can learn from and what parts of it we might want to improve. Um, so even though it's right there on the board, we'll just start off by reading it out loud. Um, Corey, I know you're up for the challenge. All of it? Sure. Okay, all right. Can we switch? It? All right. Um, to Kill a Mockingbird created a new way to think about race and inequality, where people of color were seen as folks who didn't, who deserved protection of the law. Before, there was this sense that black people didn't deserve full protection of the law and that their rights didn't matter. What To Kill a Mockingbird did was to challenge mostly white readers to think about how protecting all people, and people of color in particular, is the only way we can be consistent with the law and with the values we embrace. It was important for a white Southern writer to advance that idea. All right, great. So what do you think about this is also an element of like a good paragraph? So let's start at the beginning. Like, so you guys are pretty smart. You can teach me this. How does a good paragraph start? Irina? Topic sentence. With a topic sentence. Great. And do you want to say what that is, just in case anyone doesn't know? Um, a topic sentence states the main theme and idea of the paragraph. Right. So the topic sentence here would just be the first one. That basically sets yeah. the tone for what's going to follow. And then where do we go after the topic sentence? Then. The body. The body. But what do we do with the idea in the beginning? We expand on it. We expand on it, right? We start making some claims. We argue. Like, does that make sense? We make an argument. But we can't just make an argument without any support, right? Like, you can't just throw something out there that has absolutely zero factual basis like Michael Jordan is the greatest player of all time, better than LeBron even. Like, you need statistics, you need to cite something. So, what do you think about the support for the ideas in this paragraph? Does this, does the lawyer who wrote this cite anything about like the period and the biases and then the change in attitudes? No, there's not like a lot of support, but you can see why it would be important formula to a good paragraph. And then, how do you think it all sounds when you put these ideas together? Like, what is important for a paragraph to, to flow well? Sound good? Isabel? Transitions. Transitions, yep. So, what are some examples of transitions? Just like, however, nonetheless, additionally, things like that. Just building on ideas, connecting them. And then finally, and this is pretty self-evident, you want your paragraph to have a nice conclusion or for purposes of the acronym, an ending. So what makes an ending good? Isabel? You might um, like connect what you said in the paragraph to a larger idea. Yeah, absolutely. And you want to introduce something new maybe. You don't want to just like summarize because then it all like it doesn't really add anything, it's just kind of dull and monotonous. So basically what we've got is a good paragraph has taste. What does a good paragraph have then? Taste. Henry, yeah. what does a good taste. paragraph have? It has lots of taste. All right. <laughs> so when I say paragraph, you say? Taste. 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 Paragraph. Taste. taste. Paragraph. Taste. taste. Topic. Taste. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, we'll cut it after that. <laughs>